Tuesday Putria, Tuesday Machka. What's good, Internet? My name is Attack Slug, and welcome back to my 2K16, my career. Let's play Ebenezer's Revenge on the PS4. It is Tuesday, and we're fighting the Bulgarian brute Rusev. Yes, yes, it is Tuesday, as always, the usual disclaimer, I have not watched Raw yet, but, you know, I hear things, uh, and I'll have up my Raw reactions tomorrow, uh, at 5pm, you know, hopefully. Uh, but yes, I did hear they had Teddy Long, holla holla, Mr. Tag Team Match Playa on Raw, because, you know, in wrestling, there's never a, you're done with wrestling, there's, 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 there's once you've been established as, you know, a mainstay star at some point, there is always the chance they'll bring you back for something. It might, you know, it might just be a one-off here and a one-off there, but kind of always have your phone ready to go and get your shit and go, because uh, when they have an idea and they want you, they will certainly compensate you for that idea. So, uh, always good to hear that I'll be able to watch Raw tonight and see Teddy Long holla holla. Uh, I, don't, I, I don't ever expect to see, you know, Rodney Mack, but, you know, that's is what it is. Thuggin' and or buggin'. Anyway, uh, not much going on in terms of wrestling news. Uh, I got a little bit of non-wrestling news to follow up on the story that I was talking about uh, earlier in the week, which was the banning of Ariel... Helwani from UFC, because UFC are, is is run by petty children, uh, and they don't want a journalist doing journalism. Uh, so, the latest is that he is unbanned. He is... He, he will now... Uh, they, they have no longer, I guess, revoked his credentials for life. Uh, but obviously this story still kind of de developing, so... Um... That is my understanding, is that they have officially said he's not... Him and his and his website are no longer banned for life. So, that is the first smart thing they've done all week. Because that is just bad press all around. And you kind of don't want that kind of bad press when you're trying to run toward your biggest show ever at UFC 200. You know, that's kind of the plan. Anyway, uh, there was one piece of wrestling news that happened, or I guess got confirmed last night, and that is, uh, the injury era continues, because the Drifter now has an ankle fracture, and, uh, that is unfortunate, because, uh, certainly, he was on his way to being, perhaps, one of the top heels in NXT, people just didn't like him, so, you know, you can use that, but... Obviously, fractured ankle, you're going to be out for a little bit, so that's unfortunate. So yes, the, the injury era does continue on all fronts, uh, which that's... The last thing they need going into the, this, this brand split is more injuries. That just, you know, is going to just thin out the roster even more than it already is um, in terms of guys you can, you know, rely on and count on to carry matches and feuds and whatnot. So, that being said, I don't know. Uh, we should... This could be all she wrote. I did hear that they, they put in a seventh guy into that Money in the Bank and it's Dolph Ziggler, so I'm not sure how you guys feel about that, but um, why they waited so long to say, hey, seven guys, is kind of baffling to me, but I'm not, I'm not running creative I'm not doing the booking, so fuck if I know. Screw you, Rusev. So yeah, here we are again with this, uh... Whoa there! That was this... What the was that? Complete domination. What? Oh no, that was a signature. Screw you and your super kick. How, to, how I missed that first kick out, I will never know. I'm half awake today. It's like 9.30 in the morning. What else is new? Oh, come on, Rusev. Really? With the pump handle slam? Really? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, he's getting... Rusev Putria. Rusev Machka. Get up, Ebenezer. I don't want to get hit with whatever the hell I'm going to get hit with. Have a DDT. 
Nice to meet you. So good to see you. So yeah, we are still... Still working our way up, hopefully with a victory here. To uh, get up to rank 3, and then... The fun begins... Fun being in quotations there. Then the fun begins of attempting to knock off... The US champ... John Cena... On Legendary. And that... Will be a monumentous task... That I can hopefully accomplish, uh, you know, before the end of the summer, because obviously 2K17 is out in October, and uh, it's it's already June. It's already like the first week of June here, so that's gonna be hopefully wrapped up shortly. Oh come on, I had him! I had him! Tap, Rusev die. Ah, that would have been two taps in a row. Uh, didn't quite... Oh no. Didn't quite get it to work. Really? Really? What is he doing? Nope. Here we go. Accolade. Screw you and your accolade, Ruth. Nope, nope. Get the fuck away from me, Rusev. Get the fuck away from me. There you go. So he, he wasted his finisher there. Tr trying to tap me out. And he's going to go for a pinfall. Which is, uh... Lame. Lame, Rusev. But that gives me a signature. So therefore... Therefore... I'm going to get that AA again. Enough with the headbutts. Come on. Ugh. Ha ha, you can't see cheese. You can't see cheese. And here we go. Time for yet another Ebenezer, which should wrap up this match. Oh, put, put on the rope there. Put on the rope there. Center of the ring. Make it look good. One, two, three. There we go. Bye bye, Rusev. Bye bye. Okay, so the question is did that and will that increase our rank considering we just beat Cesaro yesterday? Or did the rank fluctuate downwards because we lost to John Cena two days ago? Like, how did that actually play? Like, they need to even be more, um. They need to expose more of those stats. Oakley Dokley, let us see what we can see in terms of uh, what's going on here. Rock Triple H on S The Rock versus Triple H on Superstars. Roman Reigns versus Sting on Superstars. Kane Neville, sure, yes. Right back, Randy Orton, maybe. Jack Swagger and Fandango is the quintessential Superstars match. Um. Jericho and Ryder versus Pentagon Jr. and Mizdow. Batista versus Kevin Owens. I wouldn't mind watching that match, but not on Superstars. Come on now. Anyway, moving into... Oh, we're almost at Fastlane. We're almost at Fastlane. Um, and I'm fighting Triple H on SmackDown. Probably. Maybe. We'll see. I think last time it didn't happen, so I got tricked. And the authority goal is going to be... That I can do. That I can do. Um, anyway, no, our rank did not increase. Maybe, perhaps, beating Triple H tomorrow will increase the rank. Even though, Triple H is not actually in the U.S. title rankings. But I beat Cesaro, who's above me. And I beat Rusev, who's way below me. And, uh, I'm not rank 3 yet. So that's unfortunate, as I am trying to climb the ladder here so I can actually go punch John Cena in the face. That's the plan, because he is the face who runs... The place. Anyway, I'm a tax slug. Thanks for watching. Uh, this is my 2K16, my career. We are rapidly approaching episode 200, which will be like on Thursday. That'll be fun. Uh, don't expect any don't expect anything different for that. I don't have any plans, but you know, we'll see. Anyway, I'll see you next time and every day for more videos right here on this channel. And I'm out.